Sunday again. We're gonna wrap up our week here in uh, Cleveland, Texas at the East Fork Lake RV Park. You can see the uh, one of the five lakes they have here behind us. Melissa says they're really just ponds, which is, but they got plenty of water. Uh, they allow you to come out here if you want to in a boat with a trolling motor uh, free because they're on private property, so you don't require a fishing license. A uh, nice little spot here. So uh, no, when last no we luck. left you, yeah, no, no, no luck, luck fishing, we had but fun, we had fun fishing and playing a stick with Annie and, you know, having a good time. So um, when last we left you, we were in Jacksonville, Florida. Well, we were actually in Tennessee, but the last load was Jacksonville, Florida. Um, left Jacksonville on Monday, picked up Monday evening in uh, North Carolina, uh, delivered uh, to uh, Ohio on uh, Tuesday morning. Um, Tuesday afternoon, we got a load offer picking up in Ohio, delivering up to Boston uh, with a backup load out of Vermont, picking up Wednesday afternoon. And delivering on Monday in Spring, Texas, which is just north of Houston. Uh, not an ideal load, five days for 2,000 miles. We can run 2,000 miles in two days, but it carried us over the Thanksgiving weekend and had us something going on over Thanksgiving as opposed to just sitting and waiting for five days. So uh, it worked out really nicely. We took our time getting down here to that. Houston. It was nice. It was a nice break. I enjoyed. Yeah, yeah it was, nice it was break. nice. Shutting down every night yep. at about 11. It was good. So we got down here to Houston Friday evening, checked into the RV park here on uh, Saturday morning, and just kind of been hanging out and enjoying life. So um, I love my job. You do? I do. The lifestyle is amazing. That we can sit here on a Sunday afternoon um, fishing. Yeah. You know, in Houston. Or right. Not Houston, but Cleveland, Texas, um, and just hang out and do our thing. So we did laundry yesterday. Yeah, laundry. Had dinner with some new friends yesterday, and clean the truck. Clean the truck. Took five minutes. I know, right? That's <laughs> one of the things, Michelle Dyer, that Melissa likes about our truck is that it can be cleaned in five minutes. Oh. Uh, vacuumed, you know, wiped down. Yeah. Five minutes. That's all it takes. She had some questions yesterday uh, on our YouTube video that we posted, and I told her I would. Uh, let her know, and I, I, I'm sorry, I can't remember those right off the top of my head, but I know one of them was, um, what's one of our favorite parts, I guess, of, of the truck, cleaning it, uh, would yeah. be one. Yeah. Um, we like the size of our truck, quite frankly. Uh, I feel like it's just the right amount of space. Uh, we've decorated it to feel like home, so I, I guess that would be one of my favorites. I think another question she had asked is, uh, what's one of Annie's, I think, favorite things to do? Uh, her pets were asking Annie uh, her downtime fun and Annie's downtime fun is anytime the truck is off <laughs> no engine running uh, she likes to uh, finally eat and then snuggle on the bed with us and then she loves ball or stick time and uh, today she's been able to be off leash out here uh, among the lakes uh, lots of land here grass and she found herself a stick and we've been playing stick for the last hour or two yeah, so it's been, it's that's something time. that annie likes to do it's she, been a good time. she likes to do that yeah, yeah. so sure. she likes to fish she just wish she would have caught a fish yeah <laughs> so if this lifestyle uh, is something that you think look you that. might be able to enjoy yeah with the, the lake back there Woo, look at that wow the sun's kind of blowing it out a little bit but um the lifestyle of being able to get out and live a little bit and do your thing and still work and get paid for it. Uh, Highfield's got a couple trucks coming available here at Panther, so get in touch with us and let us know you're interested. Uh, same household uh, teams are what we look for. Hazmat and uh, tanker endorsement on a Class B CDL. But our information is down below. Get a hold of us. If you have questions about the lifestyle, what we do, how we do it, please leave those comments as well or send us an email. We're happy to answer them for you, uh, whether it's here in the video or we'll email back or we'll give you a phone call if that's what you like to. So, um, with we're that, on Instagram as well. We're on Instagram? We are. What's that? At Luke Shire Expediter. I think it's Luke Shire underscore Expediter. What's Instagram? Instagram? It's another form of social media. Oh, yeah, that's social media guru here for <laughs> Luke Shire Expediting Adventures. You could, you could, you know, do questions there as well. Yeah, so. well, wherever, wherever you want. Sorry, yeah. it's crooked. That's it's okay. hard to hold this thing in my hand. Anyway, uh, we're going to wrap it up here. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, and uh, don't leave money on the table. Have a great, great weekend.